today we're going to be taking a look at the best wiring options for your 2016 Ford Transit T250. So here we're going to have the Curt 4-pole wiring kit, and here we're going to have the Takancha 4-pole wiring kit, and then finally on the end here we're going to have the Takancha 7-pole wiring kit. Now each one of our kits does have some slight differences, let's go take a look at some of them. Each one of our kits is going to use a powered taillight converter to convert the signal from our taillights to have the proper signal going out to our trailer and as well protect our vehicle if anything may happen on the trailer end and prevent any feedback. Now as you can see here on our Kurt and our Takancha, we're going to have some wires coming out of our converter boxes. But if you notice, on the Takancha here, it's going to have this epoxy type material. That epoxy material is actually going to fill the entire box and keep all the circuitry secure and it's going to be a little bit more resistant to any kind of rattling and any kind of damage that may be caused when it's mounted. Now these are powered converter boxes. Now both of our kits are going to provide us with wire that we can run up to the battery of our vehicle along with fuse holders and all the necessary connections to make. I just do want to mention that the Kurt here is going to provide you with a 10 amp fuse where the Takancha is going to give you a 15 amp fuse so it is going to be able to handle just a little bit more power. Now our Takancha 7 pole wiring kit, it is going to use a powered converter as well but since it is designed to work and give you the option to install a brake controller, there is going to be quite a bit more wiring and quite a bit more hardware that is going to be involved. Now the way that these are going to install is going to be roughly the same, except with our 7 pole there is going to be a little bit more. But we're going to have connectors that are going to go in between each of our tail lights, along with the wire that we're going to have to run up to the battery, and a ground wire that we're going to have to connect. Since we're going to have to connect these connectors behind our tail lights, we are going to have to pass through a grommet. Now fortunately, Kurt does provide us with some silicone so we can seal up the grommet once we get our wires through. The Takancha 7-Way is going to provide us with a whole new grommet for each side. Our converter boxes are going to be mounted using some double-sided tape that's in each one of our kits. With both of our Takancha kits, however, they are going to give us the option to zip tie our converter box with this small tab in the hole on top. Now, the way our kits are going to be designed to stay on our vehicle, our Kurt here, it is designed to stay on the inside of your hatch until you're ready to use it. Now, the Takancha is meant and designed to live on the outside, and your four pole is going to be hanging down by your hitch. Now, the Takancha 7 way also is designed to go on the outside of the vehicle. To sum everything up, as far as ease of installation goes, I think the Takancha and the Kurt 4-pole wiring kits are going to install relatively the same and it should be pretty straightforward. Now if you need something for heavy duty towing, whether your trailer has a lot of lights on it or you're towing a rather large trailer that you need trailer brakes, I would definitely say go with the Takancha 7-way controller because it has everything you need to install to get all your lights working as well as the added bonus of being able to hook up a brake controller. Now if you just need basic wiring to get you down the road, I think either one of our four pole kits, the Kurt or the Takancha, will be a great choice. Now as far as durability goes, I think both the Takanchas are going to take it here purely because of the potting material inside the converter box as well as the option to zip tie it and use double sided tape to mount it. And that will finish up our look at the best wiring options for your Ford Transit T250. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.